So first of all, let's delete everything in the scene and then let's create a cylinder. Now let's scale it on the Z axis and from the side view, let's just move it up. So it's kind of sitting on the floor. So go into edit mode and let's add some loop cuts by pressing Control R and then just clicking somewhere in the middle, press escape, go to this menu at the bottom and increase the number of cuts to around 30. Now let's apply the scale of this object. So press Control A and select scale. Now let's go into wireframe and let's create our armature. So shift A and then go to armature single bone and we're gonna just extrude this so with the bone selected press tab to go into edit mode press e to extrude and then z to extrude on the z axis now repeat that a couple of times e z e z e z and e z now with the bone selected let's go into pose mode select this top bone go to pose inverse kinematics and then add ik to bone select to new empty object and basically we are done so now if you go to object mode and you grab this empty you can see that we have some inverse kinematic action happening already so now all we have to do is click on our object and then shift click on our armature right click parent with automatic weights and now if we're going to solid view grab the empty you can see we have some amazing ik action thanks a lot for watching see you in the next one